Welcome back, everybody. I'm Jade Monkey. We're back here in Rust, and today we're talking about the Rust beta release date windows for PlayStation 4 and the Xbox. Now, before somebody loses their minds, and there'll always be one, right? They'll be like, oh my goodness, just give us a date. Step one, complain about it. Just know that as it stands currently, as, as, as of recording this, we currently do not have an official date. Now, based off of the information that we've seen from the commit list, from Twitter, from the main uh, game developer, um, Face Punch, and his, their founder, Gary, um, we're basing these, these windows off of that. So, um, and, it's, and it is just that, because, I mean, shoot, we want this as bad as everybody else. I mean, I've been waiting for this game for, shoot, what, se seven years? Seven years on console, so... Yeah, I mean, it's it hurts. It hurts a lot to wait for this. But, yeah, we're going to give you, um, or I'm going to give you, I mean, it's typically we. It's the Boyfriend Squad, me, uh, uh, Razor Tube, and BioLaser, and myself, Jade Monkey. I mean, I know we cover this a lot, but we've been waiting for this game for a long time. So we're very excited for this. By the way, we will be manning this on console, if you did not know. Also, we will be playing this uh, a lot during the beta when it does happen. So we cannot wait to get our dirty little meat sticks all over this thing. So, yeah, let's go talk about, um, and actually, what I should say, I should just throw it out there now, um, there will be cross-play between PlayStation 4 and Xbox. You heard that correctly. I have a video on that. I will go ahead and link it now in the upper right-hand corner. If you want to go check that out. And just so you know, it will not be cross-play between console and PC is not going to be a thing. So, don't freak out. I get that one a lot, too. Okay, so let's talk about our good old... Let me go ahead and switch this around here for a sec. Beep boop. Let's talk about release windows and what that means. Okay, so I'm going to first turn on the light for our scene. Do 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 boop. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's get our pointer out. Okay, so I've got this boiled down to two different potential windows, okay? Um, let's go ahead and show what this means, because I know some people ask this. Some people know what this is, but I guess some people don't. Okay, so if the year is divided up into quarters, obviously quarter one would be right here. It's not a thing. So we have quarter two, quarter three, and quarter four. Quarter two being April, May, June, which is the month we're currently in, or at least by the time you guys see this, because um, I do record these earlier. Um, yeah, it should, yeah, it's, it's going to be June. <laughs> I had to think about that for a second. Uh, we have quarter three, which is July, August, September, and then we have October, November, and December. That's what each one of these boxes represent. So I might as well just go ahead and do this, um, because it's not any of these months, and quarter two is most likely not going to be a thing. Now let me just put it out there and say this is speculation on my part, since we don't have any official information from the developer studios yet. Okay, so we're sitting in June. I really, really, really don't think... It's going to be in June. I could be totally wrong, and deep down, I really hope that I am, and I hope that we're playing this like tomorrow. I really do, and, um, but if I, I mean, if I am, I'll eat crow, but I'll be eating crow, and I will be playing the beta, so it won't matter. Okay, so now we're just looking at what's left in the air. Now, let me just point this out. So we have six months left, six whole months. So if the beta happens before the release, right, and let's say worst case scenario, it's in December, the release date for the full, full, full game, right? It's, uh, let's just say an argument's sake, it's in December. That usually means there's one month or two months after a beta. So the beta could be anywhere between, what is this supposed to represent? I forget now. <laughs> I don't have my calendar up. I always draw a blank. I have to like look at these because I'm so visual. That's September. <laughs> oh my goodness. So, you know, even in a worst case scenario, we're looking at like a September, right? But that's not the prediction for this one. This is uh, release date window number one. So, I mean, just kind of keep that in mind that we've got the whole point of this is that there is going to be a full release. But in between now, which is technically June that I deleted, <laughs> and, and the end of the year, we've got a beta happening somewhere in between here. So, uh, okay, so this first prediction goes off of the commit list that we've seen recently. And the commit list has been showing a lot of this... Oh my goodness, it always scares me every time I click it over. <laughs> I keep forgetting that when you click back in. Uh, it does, it shoots. It's going to do it again. Anyways. Okay, <laughs> that's so scary. Okay, so <laughs> it just blew my mind. So all this dummy text that, sit here, that sits here, is, and it's not encrypted, it's, it's just that it's dummy text. There's no discernible information out of this. Believe me, I've tried. There's been a lot of these, and the reason why I say that this first release window is based off of 
the idea that um, all these things are coming to a head. I, okay, so let me just go ahead and put it out there. So I think the first release window is going to be sometime in July. Look how bad I am at throwing. I really do. I And let me just... There we go. I think it's going to be sometime in July. I want to say, realistically, it's probably going to be mid or late July. And, and again, I really hope it's earlier. But here's why I'm saying that. It could even be, dare I say, let me put a different one in there. Do I have a different one? I, okay, that'll be... It could even be early, what is this, August? But I, I really think this first block, this first window, is going to be somewhere in there. And, and let me walk you through some of that logic. Right? There we go. Estimation one. Baby! Okay, let me walk you through this. So we've seen a lot of these things. As we know in the main PC branch, we have things like modular vehicles. We have things like the companion app. Um, which, I mean, you're seeing right here. Let me switch over again. I should already have this ready to go. What a tea bag. See, like, look, I'm, I'm able to do this. So we have things like the companion app, and all of these things are vanilla Rust. They will be in Rust for us. There's no mod here. This is all the standard game. So since these things will be in our version, and if they are in our version uh, for the beta, I mean, regardless, all of this is going to be in the full release. And I, I have strong suspicion that this will also be in the beta. But again, since things like modular vehicles and the companion app have to be in the full game, I, it doesn't make sense to me why they would not put it in the beta because those things are structural parts of the game, if that makes sense. So it makes sense that they would put it in there. So I know, okay, so another reason why I'm saying July is a, a few times in the past, Gary has said that he wants this to be the full game. And he also doesn't want this to be a cut-down version of the game. So with that in mind and the fact that he has another studio, I think maybe his plan is once this major release hits for PC on July 2nd, I think there's going to be a major push to see this in the beta. I, c I don't know. I could be wrong. But I, all signs are pointing to that because we're looking at things like this. Um, Double Eleven hasn't posted a commit in like over a week, at least since uh, the time of recording this. I mean, maybe... Maybe they have since then. I don't know. But uh, it points to a lot of different things. It points to something that Double Eleven, which is the studio doing the port, they're working on something big. Big enough to the point where they literally haven't done any other commits. It doesn't mean they're not working on it. It just means they're working on a larger commit. Moreover, the whole company is working on a larger commit, which says a lot. And the only thing I could really think of is an all-hands-on-deck possible internal testing. As we know, this is out for development testing out in the ecosystem for both PlayStation 4 and Xbox. We know that's a fact. Because these are very much hand in hand. Like, honestly, look at the PlayStation 4 and Xbox version is like the same thing. I know they're not, but essentially, on our side as a consumer, they pretty much are. Um, I mean, we'll be playing together in the ecosystem. So, if we see any news for either system, it's good news for the console community as a whole, is what I'm saying. So, okay, let me see if this makes sense. And hopefully, I'm not babbling too much. But so, if we've seen a bunch of these and they want to kind of keep under wraps when this release is coming. I really strongly believe that these dummy texts, these shadow texts that we're seeing from Double Eleven are potentially modular vehicles, the companion app, things like that, right? Because if they're trying to, you know, because they don't necessarily, it's not like they want to hide it, but like they have to keep it under wraps because they don't know when the date's going to be and they don't want to cause mass hysteria because <laughs> this game is going to cause people to hang on tactical cylinder. This game is most definitely going to be huge, but... I think that's why we're seeing these shadow text. Or if, they don't, if they're not sure on the stability of things, they kind of want to make sure they keep that close to the chest. It makes sense. So I don't know. With all of those things in mind and like what's coming out on PC and what's been shadowed out, there's a strong... It just points to everything funneling together. I know you guys can't see my hands, but I'm like funneling. It points to s that something is coming soon, right? And uh, it just looks like... I don't know. I just I got a feeling it's going to be in July, right? I don't know. I just do. That's release that's release date window 1. And um hopefully I just walked through all the the thought process here. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So yeah, the the shadow text and everything else kind of leading to it and the fact that I think these changes are definitely modular vehicles in the companion app, which we know exist in the game. And if we're to believe what Gary said, he wants this to be a bulk wholesale port, the full deal. It makes sense that those things are those shadow text. I don't know. Maybe that makes sense. Maybe it doesn't. Let me know in the comments if I'm out of my mind, and uh, you let me know. <laughs> you let me know down below if I'm making sense. But that's the, my first prediction. Okay, so uh, we'll take a little promo break here, and I'll show you. Okay, so 
I, I know the PC version's out now, and we're, we're like painfully waiting for this thing to come out. But like, I do have videos out there that'll help you get started for this thing going to maybe ease the pain of the wait. Because believe me, I'm just as purple as you guys are. Blue, now it's purple. That's right. You know what I'm saying? So wouldn't it be great to know when somebody is doing this to your base, right? Wouldn't it be nice to know when somebody is just you're offline and wouldn't it be great to know when somebody just popped one of your walls well i'm telling you right now i already made a video and a build on this called rust offline raid protection and yes you will get something on your phone that says this you're getting raided so if you're interested in something like that and I, i'm telling you this is the standard in our base now and it will be during the beta um, I have offline raid protection video. Uh, it's a build that I did, and uh, you can check it out now in the upper right-hand corner. So if you're down with that, go check it out, man. It's awesome. It's worth it. I'm telling you. Those are so rowdy. I like it, though. Okay, let's go on to the second window. Okay, so with everything in mind that we just talked about, right, with uh, things getting pushed, I think if somehow there's there's an issue... Or, you know, like it takes a bit longer for the integration of the modular vehicles. And let's say there's some server issues. There is a potential for another release window, I believe. Personally, me. I think... <laughs> it's not going to be quarter two. At least not for this prediction. It's not going to be these two, because that's what we have downstairs. Actually, it could have been part of this one. <laughs> Can I throw a box down? Did I, oh, man. Did I erase them all? Let me build one while we're talking about it. <laughs> oh, Ed Panda. Okay, I'm crafting one. Okay, so the next biggest potential is going to be, honestly, I think, was this September? August, <laughs> which I deleted like an idiot, is August or September. I, I really, I just, I strongly believe that it's not going to be in quarter four at the beta because that would mean literally, literally, that if the latest it would come out would be December and you'd have to ha release a beta, be finished with it, integrate all the changes here, and then release it, that's such a tight window. So I really think the next logical explanation for a release window would definitely be something like, um, what is this, August, September? Why am I so bad at months when I'm, oh my goodness, August, September. Let me, let me put my little box down here. And that's like, and maybe that's been the, the total plan all along for them to do something like that. But I, I strongly believe that the third quarter is the strongest quarter for this thing to happen with everything in, in place. And that's also pending that nothing bad has happened. Like, you know, they didn't run into massive problems. But I think we would have heard about it by now. Gary's been pretty forthcoming with those things. So, um, so yeah, that's my prediction. The release window 2 is going to be somewhere in uh, August, September. Yeah, I think it would be like more like late August, maybe early September for Window 2. Now that I'm thinking about it, because these represent an entire month. And then our first prediction is, honestly, any time in July and like early September. I'm sorry, August. Am I? Why do I keep flipping those dates? I'm so sorry. I'm so bad. So any time like early August, I think. Uh, honestly, I hope it's Window 1. Or, uh, yeah, scratch that. I hope it's option zero, which is tomorrow, but it's not going to happen, at least not that I can tell. Um, so, but yeah, I, I just, I hope we're all wrong, and I hope we're all playing this together and clapping each other's cheeks out there on the beach with rocks and stuff. So, anyways, that's been my release date window. Sorry we had to do another one of these. I was hoping the last one I did was the last one we had to do because I was hoping we were getting it earlier. But, I mean, we'll keep pushing. We'll keep checking things, checking the commit list, you know, uh, turning over rocks to see what we can find. Because we're just as anxious to get this as you guys are. And uh, hopefully we see you guys in the next video slash live stream. Uh, do know that I do stream this often. Uh, we're playing it, on <laughs> I'm playing it on the PC now. Right? But uh, we will be playing this. We will be making this on console. Let me just trash in this place. Yeah! <laughs> we will be making this on console. And rest assured that when this beta comes out, this is an excellent way to know when all of this is going down because we are going to be all over this thing. Like, playing it nonstop. And we, we just cannot wait. And we'll be manning this, obviously, during release. I don't know if you guys can, <laughs> you guys can hear me over all that. We'll be b b playing this on the main release as well. So, uh, you know, stay tuned. An excellent reason to subscribe and turn on notifications if you have not already. 
And I do appreciate you guys. Uh, I'm mad excited for this game, and so are the boys, the boyfriend squad. And uh, hopefully we see you guys uh, soon enough in the beta, right? With, with spears and rocks and stuff. It's going to be great. Okay, love you. Bye. Let's see if we can crash this one too. Ready? Let's see if we can get a good one going. I have to get some height. I'm not going to lie. Ready? Speed! Yes! Oops, oops, I had my admin stuff. I was flying around. Oh, I still am. Okay, there we go. Boop!